What's up, Fish Tank Junkies? It's Tony here, also known as Hose21, back with another video. This video, I'd like to talk about hiding fish again. But before I jump into that video, please hit that like button, subscribe, bang on that bell to get my latest video notification. Well, at the time I was shooting this video, I was going to show you guys a fish that's always hiding. He made about a 15 minute appearance and now that I'm ready to shoot the video, the joker is nowhere in sight. It's some red tailed shark. I haven't seen him in a long time. Hopefully, he'll come out before the end of this video and I actually have a couple of clown loaches in there too that I haven't only seen but like twice since putting in there. I hate it. I hate it. Pay good money for you guys. There he, there he is. There he is. That red tail. I caught a little glimpse of it. Just before I went into my tirade, he, he popped out for Papa. But yeah, as I was sedating, I mean, obviously in the fish keeping hobby, all fish ain't going to suit your needs as far as seeing them. But for the most part, I try to stay away from them. I'm sorry, I just do. I want to see my fish. I just want to see my fish. Some of them are so beautiful, you just don't get to see them. I mean, if you're going to give them a somewhat um, natural habitat, it doesn't have to necessarily look natural, but, you know, hiding spaces that they would do if they were in the wild, creeping up on things. I mean, you can have a tank with no decorations in there or something, and you'll see them, obviously, but they probably are a lot more comfortable showing up. You know, I mean, I'm sorry, they're a lot more comfortable in hiding. Look at that dwarf, Grammy. Grammy. I think he's beautiful. I have another one in here, too. Where did he go? There he is. It's beautiful little things. Brilliant color on them, too. The video is not quite capturing that, but they have some beautiful fish. They have some little red ones that I got to get, too those rummy nose right there man them things are expensive I was in a different pet shop grabbing my food there's that shark there he is told you I had one I was buying my supply my food supplies I looked at the price of their rummy noses four bucks each four bucks each I'm I'm all I'm almost beginning to believe they tell you they need to be in groups of six or more so they can make that 30 bucks off of you $4.99 fish ain't gonna do them no good or $3.99 but four bucks for those little things I didn't pay that price because I got them in a group deal along with a lot of other fish and I only paid 20 bucks for like 25 fish everything almost everything you see in here but the angelfish and the garamis but yes there he is again must be hungry out on the prowl I'm normally at work this time of day, so I guess maybe he might be coming out this time of day all the time. I don't know. But I never get to see him in the evenings when I come home. Garami, look good. Yeah, that's a beautiful fish. I wish I could catch the right angle to show you that blue on him. My plants are growing in pretty good that I broke off my Amazon sword. These are the babies, I guess. I don't know what you call them. But these are the part that grow on the Amazon sword broke that off all these pieces that piece that piece beginning to grow I'm getting new growth out of them too soon I guess they'll be the mother plant and having babies too my angels be going at it quite a bit I'm not sure what's male what's female but I know I see some head-to-head -head competition a lot of times there's a lonely rainbow that I put in there. I got some more, but I'm going to catch him and put him in the tank, my planet tank with the other ones. I just wanted to see how he looked in the tank for the most part. See if those colors will show up. Those are, that's an Australian rainbow. Not quite the beauty of a Bosmani or Millennium rainbow or anything like that. But I do love those rummy noses, man. I like those. But four bucks each. And you gotta buy, you know, it's best to buy six or more. Well, I wouldn't have to buy six because I already got some. But still, just for that little tiny fish, man, I know I'm going to do it eventually. Unless somebody has some 
that they're getting rid of, which don't want anyone to leave the hobby or anything like that. But if it means me getting some cheap rummy nose, I'm all game. I'm game. I'm game. So, oh yeah, he's that red tail is out quite a bit. Got to be hungry. Now I'm wondering if he's out at this time of night all the time. I have to figure that out. I'll be watching for that towards the weekend. Well, with that being said, I'm going to catch you guys a little bit later. Might even do another video later on today because I got some things I've been thinking about. Until then, God is love and be blessed, people.